Hey you, it's Jess here and welcome back to my channel. Today this is a weird start to my plan with me. Um, so I started filming my usual plan with me, like talk, uh, voiceover, and I did a little bit of the bass, basically just the what, bottom washy. And then I was like, I'm gonna stop. And then I was planning to do a talk through for the rest of the plan as I go. So you didn't get to see the bass. And then I had a whole bunch of video editing disk space fun and I ended up losing the um, first clip of where I was putting the stickers down. I showed you the kit. This week we, it is my RSL um, uh, inserts and we are using this bell kit from Caress Press. And I, so I lost all that original footage to be able to do an intro here but then my first talk through clip I talk about how there was an intro. So I had to go back, I have to go back here and like film this intro now <laughs> to let you know what I'm doing. But yes, basically I've just been in a weird planning mood and it's just doing the base film just wasn't working out for me. And yeah, I mean, it's going to change next week. I did film the base entirely, but this time I just wasn't in the mood. I just wanted to plan by myself kind of thing. But um, I did plan the rest of the week talk through with you guys. So we're just about to go right into that. But I just needed to do a new intro because I lost the original footage. Okay, here we go. Okay, we're going to get into some actually weekly planning. I have done the base and a little pre-planning since you guys saw the clip. Um, I, it wasn't a very long clip, so I probably didn't get to say a lot. But yeah, we're going to do some talk through plan as I goes uh, every couple of days until the spread is finished. So I've done a new thing here where I've decided to put this um, dashboard sleeve from Rose Colored Days on each of my weeks. I've actually slit um, like so it can just like, pop in and out of the rings. Um, I actually done that so I can actually move it around as much as I want. But I've been keeping my current kit in there and I've decided, I used to have it at the front, but now I've decided just to have it in within the week so I can easily get to stickers. And we're just going to take this page out and do it Monday and most of Tuesday, I think. Um, let me just zoom it in. The door is open, so sorry if there is noise, but it's a really nice day today. It's like 18 degrees Celsius, which um, that's nice for here. <laughs> so it's like actually spring right now. I'm just going to take off. Um, so I'm filming this on Tuesday, and I've just finished the first custom for this week. So we're going to fill in Monday here. Obviously, we're. Um, color blocking and I've just put in coffee Monday and draw and I've been adding these little um, accoutrement ma onto everything because it's Rococo. It has to be over the top, it's gold, it's shiny. Um, yeah, I think it's looking really cute so far. So let's have a look. Monday I've got my draw and my coffee. I need to put in that I did put a video up. Um, I got a video up on Wednesday, but to get a video up, I'm just going to use a little thing for that. And let's go find this heart. Make sure we get the same one. I wasn't sure if I was going to put that um, video up, and I did end up doing it. So I'm going to get my Clever Girl Craft Heart here, and I'm going to use a script. Now there is going to be some stuff in here from my um, haul that I filmed on Monday night. I got some new mail in, so sorry for the spoilers because that haul is coming on this Wednesday or Monday or Friday. I'm not sure yet, um, but the week that you're seeing this video and next week for me filming this. So I'm just going to put this little plan with me script in here from Adorable Amy Designs. It is so cute. I tried out a different font this time. Um, then we got Happy Mail this day. Should I just do another like skinny, another little thing? We actually have a Happy Mail icon here, but we're gonna cover it up. So 
sorry. Because we also want to put in that we got bubble tea, which is important. Bubble tea. And we also want to put in that we watched a movie, which now I'm thinking of it. So I, um, it's Tuesday right now. And I watched a film today. I watched um, Eurovision Fire Saga to gear up for Eurovision next week. Um, and then, but yesterday on Monday, I watched Blades of Glory, which is also Will, Will Ferrell film. I just really love Will Ferrell's films. I just, I love them. So I'm not ashamed. You like what you like, you know? Everyone's got different tastes and that's my taste. I think he's hilarious. So one, two, and three. I'm gonna put in filming down here. So we need, um, I haven't picked any stickers out, but we want to put in a bubble tea. Do we just want to put that or do we want to put like the full girl? We're gonna put it in here actually. So yeah, we should put her in. This from Marge Goodies, so cute. Sadly, like I put up a haul and like the next day her stickers arrived. So I didn't want to wait a whole month like to use them. So I filmed a haul. So that was on my Instagram. Let's put on a little bow here. She has a bow and a hair. Maybe we could put it, no, we'll put the bow on her top of her other bow. So what oh, we're going to put there, sorry. Gosh, happy mail, okay. So now we have happy mail, I think because we have a little thing. This is probably too big, so we're going to use a Scribble Prince Co. Once again, spoiling my hole, but whatever. <laughs> I want to use these stickers now because they're so cute. Um, so we put that little box in there, which is literally what my happy mail looks like. I can hear a child. <laughs> a child. Um, I'm gonna go into seasonal for Blades of Glory because I don't know if I have like a, like an ice skating kind of sticker like in my winter stuff. I might have to get my winter thing out because I have my snow. Does anyone ice skate in here? They're all skiing. I don't think I have any ice skating stickers to mark, um, maybe I'll just use this little frozen one, but it looks like happy. Hmm. Um, maybe you can go into license, might find something in here, puzzle the Lord of the Rings and the Witcher. Would this be silly? Like. The little twin stars, we can cut them down, I think. Um, but I think they kind of make me think of um, like ice skating and it kind of makes me think of um, Chaz Michaels and what's his name? Gosh, I've already forgotten their names. I, they need to be full because they look like they're ice skating. So I'm just going to have to write Blades of Glory very small. And then the final one was filming, and that's crooked. Let me just fix that up. Okay, filming. I'm going to use a typical paper shire. But yeah, once the hole came in, I was like, well, I did some drawing during the day, and then the hole came in. Um, and that was that. I was like, well, I got to film this hole, and then it was like an hour and 19 long. Um, I have some hole, uh, some delivery scripts because it was like a DHL delivery so I'm just gonna put delivery here and then put DHL and then because I want to I'm going to use some more of what was in the hole I got some scripts for my actual milk bubble tea place more tea so I have to use that from those two scripts are from um Kinsey's Creations, and then we're going to put Blades of Glory in. I love that. This is mind bottling. Mind bottling? You know, like when your mind is in a bottle. You're so confused your mind is in a bottle. I just... <laughs> yeah. I'm going to use this film... I'm actually out of gold film scripts. If you watch my shop with me, you saw that I bought some new film scripts. Um, 
So I'm just going to use this Lettuce to Apollo one, boy one. And Lachlan's just texting me that on their way home. So let's quickly do this. <laughs> Not that I like, don't want to. Um, oh, there's a cute little asterisk here, which might be cute with Blades of Glory. Like they're shiny. And then we could put, just like putting, I haven't put like, um, foil icons into stuff in a long time. So, I don't know, but I would try it out again. I think it works perfectly with this set. Yeah, I'm liking that. Okay, but yeah, so Lark is on the way home, so we want to film this before they get here. So, Tuesday, oh my god, you guys. Today, you probably saw it on my, will this fit? Yes, just. We'll bump it up against the glitter header. Um, but today I did a workout. What? <laughs> yeah, I never work out, so it's kind of shocking, but I did. Okay, I actually don't have that great lot of workout stickers. I need to actually... Okay, I'm telling myself if I work out every day this week, then I am allowed to buy some new workout stickers because none of these are working for me. I don't use a treadmill anymore, and I do like... That like, might work, um, but yeah, I've been just doing a workout video. Maybe I can use like this girl. Yeah, I have literally nothing that works for these video workouts. So I'm going to use this girl. She's technically doing like yoga or Pilates, but I was doing like a dance workout video. So, um, two, two thousands emo pop punk whatever so there was like um it's a full out boy and um <laughs> evanescence bring me to life and there was also it finished off with um mr brightside from the killers it was so good i was freaking dying i was my my arms were just waving around like noodles but i was singing along at the top of my lungs to mr brightside it was great i'm mr brightside and it's all the same. <laughs> anyway, so I use a workout script there from Scroll Prince Co. I actually did it. I'm so happy with myself. Look at me go. It really did release the serotonin mang. <laughs> like, whoo, a serotonin go. So now I'm going to put this bigger box in for Fire Saga. And what can I use for Fire Saga? And then Eurovision next week. What am I going to use as stickers? You know? What am I going to use? I, don't, I just go to my license one usually because it has like different lots of stuff in it. I don't know. What could be considered good for that? Actually, it just cut through looking through some stuff, but why don't we try looking at emojis, like maybe something that looks like it's singing. I don't know. This one kind of looks like it's singing, like it's sort of, uh, but um, these little faces could look like singing, like they're happy faces, but their mouths are open. Are we going to do that? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know you guys, maybe I have to get some like stuff that specifically would work with the Eurovision next year, but um, so it's Fire Saga, and I actually don't know what the rest I'm going to do for this week, so, so I got in Eurovision Fire Saga, and yeah, I think I'm going to leave the rest of tonight. Uh, oh, I did send files. Okay, I have a sticker for that, so I'm going to put that in. So, we're just going to put that in. And then we have a little space for whatever we do for the rest of the night. Um, so, we have a cute little flat lay kind of sticky from Paper Shire. And once again, I have a new script for sending files from Kinsey's Creations. You just wait for that hole, you guys. It is big and it's great. All right, so that is everything for today. We're gonna fill out the rest of Tuesday, maybe on went tomorrow or even Thursday and Friday. But yeah, 
I'll be back in the next clip. All right, it is Thursday and we're coming back to do some more. So we need to finish up Tuesday. So I think I'm gonna put in, they had ice cream and watched Border Town. So I'm wondering if I can just use a TV little thing. We've got one of them here. This actually works out perfectly for Border Town. And I don't think we have room for, we do have room for a fancy label for ice cream. Sure. Let's get the desserts stickers out. Um, we didn't have a bowl of ice cream. We did actually have a uh, ice cream cone. Like a Cornetto style that we bought at the shops. So maybe I could use one of these from Paper and Milk. These are old stickers, so I might use this one because it looks cute and I think it'll go well. I might have to cut off the little mar at the bottom just so it can fit. This still looks like an ice cream cone, right? There you go. Because um, it's hot and it's sunny and we're all about ice cream now. <laughs> One big thing I learned about Finns when I moved here is that they love ice cream. So when it gets sunny and hot, they actually bring out extra ice cream freezers <laughs> in the shops. Okay, so now I'm going to do Wednesday. We had the shop with me. I did some drawing and I did another workout. But I think we're going to put in a little TV icon in here just to put in Bob's Burgers. Okay, now I can make room for putting in a workout. So you use a fancy label with a pattern. And she just use the same workout sticker. She use a different pose because she looks really cute. Now I need a gold workout sticker. So you can put that in. Tweezers, please. Workouts. So yes, I worked out two days in a row. My my plan is to work out when Lark is at the office, um, which isn't for the rest of this week because today on Thursday is a public holiday and then they're working from home on Friday. So next week we'll do Monday to Wednesday of workouts again. Well, we didn't do Monday this time, but next week we'll have the three days of working out. And I think that'll be good for a start just because my body is hurting a lot <laughs> and it needs rest, I think. I don't want to like go crazy right at the beginning, but like make myself do this first side of the week of workouts then we had um we got friends and burgers got it last week and i don't know it was just really tasty <laughs> so um i just really felt like friends and burgers again so that's what i got and then i did want to mark in the end it's not the kind of the end of the day but i did have a short nap those are like the main parts of the day, I think. So we're going to use tomato burgers. Let's get the food album out. Uh, we have these ones. Do you have any other different? I think we have another burger one in here from Screw Prince. Got this one. Maybe we use this light corally pink. And this one's cute because it comes with a little um, like drink and it's cat shaped and looks really cute. And I do have a script for friends and burgers. This is, oh no, I've got a few more left. <laughs> Thank gosh. But that is from, they don't do scripts anymore. From It was the Pretty Pink Co. And I don't think she does scripts anymore. But I really liked this custom. And then now. Nap, nap, nap. Go to my relax section. Maybe I'll use one of these new paper K ones. Which will again be in my hole coming up. <laughs> and we do have nap stickers. They're a bit small, but that's alright. We'll just plop this in here. Nap. 
So that is Wednesday all completed. Where did the sticker just go? I just lost stickers. Where did they go? I just took them off the scissor. Oh, well. This stick is somewhere. They're probably on me somewhere. But oh, well. <laughs> oh, do I want to put any, like, um, foil on this stuff? Um, we'll put a cute little foil bow on the ice cream. And maybe on this little relax nap bear. I think we're good for that. So now we're going to do a little bit of Thursday. That is today, so. I already have film in here. We're having a day off. I probably will draw later though. <laughs> so we'll see. But I am filming this little section. And I did want to put in that the main thing so far today can we move put a little oh, freaking um sometimes it's okay to pick things up off of bougie boxes yes all right so we can push this up a little just make a bit more airy space and then we'll put breakfast in here breakfast and then we did watch a little Bob's Burgers again. All right, so for breakfast, I have the perfect sticker because we've done it a couple of times now from Bare Necessities. We've had um, pancakes with some bacon and eggs, and this is literally what this sheet is. So <laughs> it's perfect to mark this breakfast. I know it's quite quite ridiculous, but we just use a little, we just have like a small pancakes, a couple of pieces of bacon and an egg, and it's so good. The secret to making is you cook the bacon from a cold fry, on a fry pan, cold, cook the bacon, then put it on some paper towel to get rid of the excess fat. Then you cook your eggs and leftover bacon fat with a little bit of um, spray oil just because I feel like bacon fat is still kind of sticky with the pan. So you fry the two eggs and as I crack them in before they start really cooking I make sure I put in um, the everything but the bagel seasoning from Trader Joe's. So that goes on the eggs and then we fish the eggs out I quickly wipe the pan clean, do a little bit more spray and then do the pancakes and then well, and keep the plate of the eggs and bacon like um, on the stove so it stays hot. Yeah, it's perfect. <laughs> perfect big breakfast. <laughs> We're loving it. But I just put in Bob's burgers again and then I'm filming and the rest of the day um, is up to us. It is only 1.42 so plenty more of the day left. I do want to mark in Friday a little bit more pre-plan. I don't have another video going up, but we do have groceries being delivered as well as cat food. So I want to put those in. Um, I'm just going to put in, I'm going to put in this way. Let's see how I do it. So uh, we have groceries being delivered, so we need shopping. Um, that's a hanger. <laughs> um, can we use any of these? You could probably use this, um, this is Tassel Plan who closed quite a while ago now. But I still have some stickers, so I do want to use them up. Um, so use up that sticker there, and then for cat food, I have... Oh, I can use the blue again, that's kind of cute. Cat food from Whimsical Cat. And now I just need my scripts, because I have scripts for both of these things. <laughs> you guys, I am loving my script sticker book. It's just, it's perfect. It's so much easier to do and use. Grocery delivery. So put that in, it's from station stickers. And then I have just the script delivery from um, Kinsey's Creations, which I think is perfect because the sticker already says cat food, and now it says delivery. Yes. But yeah, I'm loving this sticker album, especially since I got these um, 
dividers that just pop right in from the grumpy tortoise. They're like, it's perfect. It's so easy to go through my scripts now. But I just wanted to put those two in on Friday because I know that they are happening. And I think that's everything. Yes. So, um, oh, I didn't do, let me put that back into the planner. And I just needed to take some stuff off the work here. I did work on a Wednesday. And we're working on the Caress Press Custom right now. So, perfect. Okay. That is everything until next part. Alright, so we're now we're planning Thursday. I completely forgot that this was a talk through, so I put these stickers down on Thursday. Um, but we're talking through now. Okay, I remembered. So first of all, I put in a cute little um, cookie and milk. Um, let me just put this in. Sticker because from Paper K, which is in my next in the hole coming up on Friday, um, because we baked cookies. Um, I baked, uh, and then of course there was a triple jump stream, and then we started playing Mass Effect. So let me just write those out. Okay, so yeah, we baked um, these cheesecake uh, chocolate chip cookies and it's like you, you only use like um, cream cheese, sugar, butter, flour and then the chocolate chip so it's like five ingredients and they were really tasty. It was nice to have like the little twang of cheese in there and then obviously Mass Effect came out so um, Locke played it back in the day like 20, 2007 I should say not 2017 2007 and um, but <clears throat> they played it on their PC, so I wasn't able to play it with them. Whereas now we're playing it on the PlayStation, so I'm able to play it with them, which is super fun. Um, what are we going to put in here? We've got Boba Chick and then... What is the computer thing? Um, uh, a wiki hole, <laughs> yes. So I, um, yeah. I got caught in a wiki hole this day. I looked up certain things. You know how you like, you look up something and then you see like related stuff or related people and you keep going deeper and deeper and deeper. And I ended up like um, this hilarious section where, so my favorite artist group of all time is the Pre-Raphaelite Brotherhood, but I never knew that they had a nemesis artist group. Um, who hated them, <laughs> I called the clique, and it's so lame, <laughs> they even like, the clique even painted themselves like, in a scene at art gallery looking disapprovingly on the like pre-Raphaelite guys and Oscar Wilde and things, and I guess they're like, I would, I would, I can't say they're more conservative than pre-Raphaelite pre Brotherhood because their art is more about social things and uh, making awareness of um, social issues in Victorian society, which is a common Victorian painting thing. But they didn't like the Pre-Raphaelites because they were too fantastical. And the Pre-Raphaelites loved to paint, like, religious and medieval and more literary scenes. So, yeah. Except a couple of the clique were actually friends with Pre-Raphaelite guys. So... You know, that was pretty funny. I'm like, <laughs> why is there a rival group? And the thing is, I like the rival group's paintings as well. So I don't know what their problem is. <laughs> so I put that wiki hole in there. And, um, but I enjoyed, I enjoyed reading about them. I thought they were really, really interesting. Um, <clears throat> maybe I'm going to put in this box here and then um, maybe we'll use because we don't have any more blue to worry about we can use whatever stickers we want and I did pull out a gold TV icon and I think I will use it <clears throat> just because even though I have a TV little thing left I want to use I've already pulled this out and I want to use the little mini TV from <clears throat> uh, Scribble Prince Co. And then I have a Crafts by Tally little pizza box. It's really cute. And then I just have a paper shy little 
vanilla and bear and a another thing from the haul, sorry. <laughs> um, <clears throat> letters to Apollo, lazy time. So let me put this in. So after I learned about all the Victorian silliness, I we got pizza from Daddy Greens, which sounds terrible. I have my coffee, it's morning of Tuesday now. <laughs> Whoops. <clears throat> and um, they, they're like, I think the co-owner is actually from New York, so they have like New York Neapolitan type um, uh, pizza, which is tasty. And then we had the dessert they serve as sea buckthorn panna cotta at the moment. That was tasty. It's a bit more like a yogurt, but still pretty good. Um, as per usual, I get the pepperoni pizza with pineapple because that's, that's the best thing to eat ever. So now for Saturday. My shop sale ended. Um, so I want to put in that I did some drawing um i'm gonna put drawing here and then we're gonna put this little thing for tidying up we cleaned the bathroom and the kitchen and when i, when I meant when i mean i cleaned the bathroom like i scrubbed the shower glass and <laughs> I cleaned the mirror and just everything, the floor, whatever. I did it all. And then we'll put in a drawer. And then we will put in these little um, bows in the drawer. Let me, oh, I have to go back and put some gold bibs and bobs on these. But I'll do that at the end before I show you the finished spread. Okay, and then we draw and then we tidy it up, and then um, I need to put in the espresso house. We got some one of these. I like these actually. <clears throat> I got we got espresso house, um, which we used to order all the time back in Olu. We haven't actually ordered it yet in um, Helsinki because it's like it's a chain, like a coffee chain, and I had we both had iced chais, which are really good. Just using this little, um, oh, that's from Paper K, and then this is from Paper Milk, little coffee. And then Espresso House is from the Pretty Pink Co, but they don't do that anymore. <clears throat> and then we just spent the night playing some more Mass Effect. So we did watch Bob's Burgers, and there's a room. So maybe I will put that in. I didn't have a TV, so I'm going to have to get... The TV little things, so I have to get one of those icons out to use it. The only, uh, the only thing with pre-pulling stickers is you're not always entirely sure what's going to fit and what's not. So, put the little TV in and then we'll put all oh, these um, PlayStation controllers are from Scribble Prince Co. And I think I'm going to have to go get another sheet of them because they're perfect. So, there we go, it's Saturday, and let's finish up on Sunday, so we've got the pink colour, um, I did some more drawing, then I had a YouTube bench, which may be looking at this, um, so it came up with another thing, I might just put two of these in here, no. Okay, um, maybe we can put a square in. Square is also patterned, but does that matter? Not really. Uh, we could replace this. Is this the same? This is different sizes. Oh wait, I've got this one right here. <laughs> we could replace the patterned one, so we can use the square box. There we go. It's easy to put up, pull up stickers um, on this paper. Uh, I mean, not this paper, on these bougie boxes. So this is the last of these little um, bows, which is perfect. And then, so we drew, and then we had a YouTube binge. So I'm just using this little icon from Crossroad Tower, I think. 
and then the script from Station Stickers. And then that night we had, I'm going to use um, some patterned washi because the little things have like a front and end and this is like a long script. So just gonna put this in here. They're all like header size, so if you want it wider, you have to um, put some work in. But I'm just use this little sticker from Caress, um, Squirrel Prince Co., the cute little kitty burger and fries, and then the McDonald's script from her as well. And then we just need a little thing, TV little thing here. And then we're going to slip. So maybe I can use the rounded quarter label here. Still like hmm, too small. Maybe this one. It's kind of the same size. Hmm. Oh, we have the pattern one. The you put that in there. <laughs> so that's all those stickers done. Let's put in these last ones here. So, as usual, Bob's Burgers, and then we'll put in this, hmm, it kind of works more on this side. Maybe we'll just do that. That's fine. Um, I'll fill these out. I should put in a sleep early, so now let me put it all back in. All right, here is the finished spread. Um, I think it looks so beautiful. I love the color blocking. As per usual, at the moment, it's just being my thing, I guess. And I love having all the extra little bits and pieces. I just added a bunch of foil pieces to the set. But what we have left is still some bows, which is nice. Just a couple pieces left of that sheet. We have some boxes and some more of that kind of stuff. More of this sheet, but maybe you can incorporate it next time. Sorry, a truck just went by, I apologize for that. It's been a bit loud here, but that is the finished spread of Belle. If you liked it, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more, and I'll see you next time. Bye.